Hey guys, welcome back to Pokemon Platinum. We are in Veilstone City on our own little rock here, and we're gonna head right to the gym. Uh, I, I went ahead and played through the rest of the Lost Tower and through Route 215 on my own. Uh, nothing too exciting happened. I hatched my Eevee. It's got a rash nature. Oh boy, he's singing. It is Crash Awake. The ring is my sea. Alright, what are you on about? Hello, dude and young lady. You're challenging the gym leader, are you? Let me tell you now, she's young, but she's a born genius. I tried training with her, and I was stunned by how tough she was. Whoops, I better tell you who I am. I'm the triple threat gym leader in Pokemon, wrestling, and song. I'm Crasher Wake of Pastoria Gym. We'll meet again. Alright, dude. Dot dot dot. So, uh, yeah, McKenna. Good luck with the Pokemon Gym. Thank you. Anyway, my Eevee hatched. It's got a rash nature, so, um... Giving Glaceon that nice special attack boost. Unfortunately, my other Eevee has Calm Nature, so its attack is going to be neglected a bit. Okay. Um, but I think it'll be okay. As I was saying, I really I need Leafeon for Crash or Wake's. Uh, what am I doing here? Uh, ground water types, the ones that Luxio isn't gonna be able to hit. Uh, boy, that's the next gym, so I'm gonna have to start training up. I I'll probably end up running back to Eterna, I guess. I guess I'm not gonna get Fly. Okay, this is different than... Oh. <laughs> that that was it. What do I do? Oh, that's that's oh. Well, that's fun. <laughs> this is cute. Oh my god. I love this. All right, let's go fight this guy. Fight our way through all the trainers, the karate quads. I think Star Raptor is gonna be able to take down all these trainers and we're gonna leave the XP share on Ponyta until we get to, what's her name? The gym leader, Maylene? Oh my God. And, uh, I think I'm gonna give, just give her an orange berry. I only have one citrus berry. I should have grown some. I was thinking about it. I was thinking about growing berries. Um, okay. I'm concerned that that's not one-shotting you. Does Star Avia learn a new flying type move sometime soon? Cause that would be nice. I'm gonna check, and I might take the uh, XP share off of Ponyta if if Staravia gets another move. Cause it would probably be able be useful for me to be able to one shot some pokes, pokes, pokas, poke. Poka. Sorry. <laughs> Alright. You got any more for me? I guess you got one more. You got plenty of Pokemon to throw at me so I can get some experience here. Ugh. Boy. 
Okay, hers is level 29, isn't it? Hmm. <laughs> Me questioning whether I've trained enough. Well, at least none of them did any damage on me. Alright, hold on. Alright, she learns Aerial Ace in one level, but it's the exact same base power. I guess it's still worth learning, but, I, but we should level up um, even with the XP share, I think. Even if it takes getting to... I don't think it'll take getting to the gym leader. We're not that far. I'm leveling up. You got three pokes for me to take down. Yeah, we're gonna get there. I know Aerial Ace never misses. I don't know how much- I don't th think that really helps me in this gym, but... I am really excited to get to playing black or white. And also, to starting my Nuzlocke's the reach region. Like, I've never played Fire Red or Leaf Green. Or really red or blue for that matter. I, I played Pokemon Yellow. That was my one Gen 1 game. And then I played Let's Go Eevee. So. I'm excited to do to, to do a Nuzlocke of Fire Red or Leaf Green. <sighs> My brilliant diamond Nuzlocke is kind of giving me anxiety because I had such a ugh, gosh Garchomp. That's that's what's scaring me about this Nuzlocke. Hey, I struggled. I feel like I'm. Can I? Can I come through? Do I gotta? Mm. Gotta punch this um, guy over here to break those tires, I think. Well, let's go get this guy. Where the karate quads? Good for you. I feel like whenever I record first thing in the morning, my voice isn't quite ready for it, and I keep having to clear my throat. But yeah, I'm literally recording this, and then editing this, and then uploading it, so... When you're watching this, I will have literally just done this. Sort of. I don't think it'll take me too long to edit it, and then... Render it and upload it. Yes. Lands without fail. Yeah, there's not really... I don't know that there's a point to having wing attack anymore, so... I'm just gonna do this. Alright, Ponyta leveled up. It's kind of interesting because I know in hardcore Nuzlocke's they use the level cap rule, but I feel like I'm always going in under leveled to these battles. Not that I'm like totally doing excellent in these battles when I go in under leveled. I'm also using items, so. But I, I will definitely be getting everybody up to. Well, I, I'm not even doing hardcore Nuzlocke yet. I don't, I don't want to 
I get into doing some regular Nuzlocke's first. Oh, can't go through here. Okay. That's why I punched this punching bag, so I could... Um... I guess there's one more trainer here. Somewhere. Over... Wait. Yes, he's over here. Okay. And then we're gonna pop to the Pokemon Center real quick so I can heal up and then come back and tackle the heck out of Maylene. Alright, let's get some Aerial Ace action on this bug. Oh, I also realized that this is me not knowing Platinum because I've never played it before. I couldn't buy Flamethrower at the Veilstone department store. Uh, I guess you can get it at the, uh, the game corner, but I do not have time for that, so I got Fire Blast. Which is only 85% accuracy, so that's scaring me a little bit. Um, I think I might do some some fancy pivoting. Whoops. Try and throw someone in. Maybe like Ponyta in. And then switch to Staravia to get the Intimidate off and hopefully... Hopefully... Oh boy. Oh, okay. <laughs> Hopefully Lucario will go for... Bone. Whatever. It's ground type move and that will not land on Staravia. And it'll choose something else that I'll switch into Ponyta for. What is its move? I, I should probably check on its move set. I have a feeling. Alright, we're back in the gym and... Whoops. Mostly, um... I just... I'm concerned about Lucario's Citrus Berry. Um... Maylene's Potions. <laughs> All that good stuff. Maybe it would be nice to just uh, try and get her to use her potions on her other two Pokemon. If Staravia could get them in the red, that might be nice. Do I gotta keep going here? Okay, never mind. Alright, we gotta... How do I get over there? Whoops. Oh no. Got a little bit of puzzling to do. Oh, can I... You're gonna switch around here. Can I knock this one somewhere, somehow? I gotta do puzzling now. Okay. I think I just gotta... Whoops, that didn't really do anything, because it didn't go the way I wanted it to go. How do I break this one? Oh, I see. I gotta make it go in a square. This is gonna take a second. Alright, back to this guy. Ooh, I accidentally tapped from the wrong direction. 
Go, 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 go. Uh. Whoops. And then you're gonna go this way. So I can get back through here and <laughs> do this and get to the very scary part of the game that I have to do now where I take on Baleen. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Yep, you are. Okay, you weirdo. I'm ready. I'm ready to go. I'm, s I'm nervous. Mostly about your Lucario. Pretty much only about your Lucario. But at least, like, Prinplup has, has Peck if anything happens to Staravia with the first two. Okay, you did not faint. Oh, okay, you also did not use a potion. Is that because you're gonna murder me? Okay, cool. Well, shit. Oh my. Wealth, oh, okay, okay. Wasn't exactly expecting that. Well, I think I'm gonna switch to keep Staravia alive and actually do this lovely Prinplup Peck thing. If anything goes wrong, uh, well, I don't know. This Primplop was- oh my god. Yeah, that peck does not do much for me. Alright, I think I'm just gonna let Primplop tank some hits while I... Heal up... 50? Is 50 enough? No, I'm gonna use the Moo Moo Milk. Do I want to s I don't know if I want to switch or not. Or like, just let- I mean, it doesn't really matter if I let Primplup faint. Might as well get the safe switch. I'm not doing a Nuzlocke here. I just feel bad about letting my Pokemon faint. Alright, get this Intimidate off. Hopefully we can knock it out with an Aerial Ace. Although it would be nice if I- Oh, use a potion. Use a potion. God. I was hoping you would use a heckin' potion here. Oh. Here's hoping that Ponyta doesn't miss its Fire Blast. That level up feels good. Yeah, okay, we're gonna do this. I think Lucario should use its Bone Rush, so it'll be safe to do this. This is probably the best thing to do for my pony to actually, so it doesn't have to get hit. Oh my god, you you didn't use heckin' 
った。Well, you won't use it now, right? <sighs> You're not gonna use Bone Rush. Perfect. Alright, now I need you to not miss. Okay. Oh god, I don't like that. I don't like that. What would be really nice is if this burned Lucario. Ooh, burn, burn, burn. Yes! Hmm. Yes! <laughs> oh my god. That was perfect. Outstanding RNG right there. I love it. I love it. I win. All right. Oh, we can use fly now. So, okay, perfect. Then we can go um, grab. We can go back to a turn of forest. Uh, do leaf. Moss stone fun and get our leafy on. Okay. All right. So we're gonna check out this nice, sweet new badge here. By the time I get to uh, recording the next week, you know they've all gone dull again. So we'll just focus on this one, and I will. I will get all the other ones shine. I think I'll shine up the other ones before I do the next gym battle. Um, so when we're shining up the new one, it just gets shiny along with the other ones. And um, let's see, where are we going? Oh, next time on Pokemon Platinum, we are going to the Galactic Headquarters to take on the Galact team, you know. Galactic, whatever. Uh, thanks for watching. <laughs>